How are you doing? Um, you all know, you already know if you see my mouth moving slow that I'm using my uh, laptop webcam. And for the life of me, I don't know why it is so slow like this, but um, I'm sitting at home, chilling on the couch, watching TV. Um, and as I'm sitting here, I began to think about some stuff uh, about life in general um, and you know your pursuit of happiness um, as many of you know uh, if you don't I am single uh, have been so for many many years now um, and when I try to tell people that I'm single or I have not been intimate with any any anyone in over well over a year almost two um no it hasn't been two but it's been over a year I know put it like it's been so long that I've lost count um and it's and it, it's 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 now this is a personal vlog um and the reaction that I get from people when I tell them I'm single is the same. They always say, well, how can you be single? You know, you're an attractive guy. You know, you have a beautiful home. You drive your own car. You have an excellent job. You got a lot going on for yourself that somebody else would find as a hot quality in someone to be with but you know you know how you get that itch that you want scratch the sexual itch that you just ooh. but and I tell people I wasn't raised to be a whore I wasn't raised to just give these goodies up to anybody because I mean you gotta work for this like you gotta earn all of this you just don't get it just because yeah picking up where I left off sorry you, you you gotta work for all of this and you just don't get it one night because I'm horny and I feel like fucking it it hasn't worked that way for me and sex to me is emotional it's it's not just the physical act is is I get I'm like a bitch I get emotionally attached when it comes down to that, especially if it's some good. Mm, I just get attached. This is how I am. Um, so yeah, the, the, I'm just so surprised at the response that I get from everybody. Is that it's always the same oh you're you're sexy you're you you got the house you got the car you got the everything going for yourself but those are all outer things you know nobody knows what I got going on in my mind in my thoughts in my emotions sometimes and you know I, I give it up to the whores of the world and the sluts and the, and, the, and the tramps and the trollops of the world that can go out and just fuck anybody, anytime, anywhere. I, I give it up to you guys because I can't do it. No matter how horny I get, no matter how I sit on this couch alone every night, I don't get those urges to run out and just fuck random strangers or, or anything like that um I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with you if you do but for me I don't fuck random people so you know and it, it gets lonely a lot sitting on the you know, on the couch alone watching TV you know you wish you had that boo to cuddle up snuggle up level up with and just you know, I 
very much so probably if I really try not try but if I really wanted to I am sure that I don't have to be single right now um there are a couple people that have tried that I have not given a chance but that is because I'm dealing with my own issues and like and I'm I don't want to give of myself if I can't give you a hundred percent of myself if you understand what I'm saying like you you know you watching this video those of you that watch me you know you you don't want to give somebody a you know be in a relationship with somebody and you can't give a hundred and ten percent of yourself you don't want to go into a relationship giving only half of yourself because you're gonna wind up breaking up and then you're gonna wind up wasting time with somebody that you really were never meant to be with so I say all of that to say I shout out to the whores of the world um, I don't know how y'all do it I really don't but for 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 me it's rough out here being single this is a single gay man vlog um and a lot of uh, what you see on TV is so just not how the world is. Like, I was in Philadelphia yesterday, day before yesterday, day before yesterday. Yeah, yesterday, Sunday. And Noah's art came on, and I just, I just love Noah and Wade's. Relation, like I just love how there are men out there like Noah. I mean, like, ooh, not Noah. Ooh, he's too whiny. Like Wade, you know, they actually genuinely love you and care for you and show you affection and 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 has genuine love for you. So I hold out hope that there's a Wade out there for me, um, somewhere, um. And then that's partly too why I haven't jumped into anything with someone because you know you you to a point in your life where you just get tired of jumping in and out of relationships. You actually want that one, you know, person, not one this month, one next month, one a year later, one six years later. You get tired of that. It gets very draining emotionally. To do that, so like I said, shout out to the whores of the world. I don't know how y'all do it, but this one here can't do it. But um, yeah, this was just a random lonely man vlog on a Monday night, sitting on the couch watching TV. Um, I love you guys for watching, loving, listening. I love you guys. Keep on doing you. How you doing? I'm keep on doing me, literally, since ain't nobody else doing it. But um, anyway. <laughs> I love you guys. I gotta get it together, y'all. Mm -hmm. I really do. I gotta get it together.